All right, you stupid idiots. Today, let's talk about quickly this, this Osmo Pocket thing. And I got to say that I first saw the <clears throat> marketing wank about this thing coming out. And I said, oh, you know, it looks pretty cool. Um, maybe it were, it might be worthwhile looking at, buying, and then you're looking at it and you're seeing all the internet shills just going, oh, yeah, it's great. It's blah, 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 blah. Let me tell you why I think this thing sucks, okay? So yeah, the stabilization is probably pretty good. It's on a frigging gimbal, what do you expect? Gimbal equals good stabilization. It's small, which is nice. And if you look here at this thing here, what do you think this looks like? Oh, could it be, could it be, could it look like a GoPro? Anyways, from what I see, I don't have a GoPro 7 or whatever, but the stabilization in the GoPro looks pretty good. It doesn't look this bad, <clears throat> so obviously they're, uh, Getting a little touchy feely there. Uh, the lens sensor sucks. Everything sucks about it. If you watch any videos, uh, you can see that it does horrible in really contrasty situations uh, where there's a really bright sky and um, it's overexposing the scene. Everyone basically looks black in it, like a black outline. You can't even see their faces. Everyone just appears. You can't even see them and vice versa. Obviously, uh, the sky is blown out. So a lot of these, a lot of the videos I've seen are just people constantly shooting in this horrible light. I don't know if they're doing this product any good or not, but um, anyways, yeah. Just remember, you can have uh, a really good sensor in something this small. That's fine and dandy though, because if it's portable, it makes up for it, blah, 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 blah. Okay, another thing is, is you can set, you. Apparently, you can set all the manual controls uh, with the phone attached. I don't know why. I don't want my phone attached. Uh, so I got to whip out my phone and this thing and shove them and have them mate so that I can I can do manual exposure settings to get rid of that annoying over and under exposure uh, scene settings or the auto that blows out everything to hell. Okay, so yeah, so essentially you're gonna be doing this. And uh, yeah, of course, all these people are having a great time. It seems like, oh my God, it's so great. Look how great it is. Oh my God, it's so great. Okay, uh, let's see, advanced options. Yeah, here you go. So this is where you can do the ISO aperture. You can't do that without the phone. So now you gotta whip out your phone. So how pocketable does it really become at that point if you're gonna do anything that is semi gonna be decent quality? Leave this thing on auto. I'm pretty sure you're going to get crappy video, crappy exposure, crappy ISO. Oh, and the sound. So everyone doesn't seem to really care about the sound because from what I hear, it kind of sounds like this. Does it sound pretty good? I think this sounds pretty good. How about if we move it over here? Oh my God, it sounds great over here. Can you guys hear me over here? Can you guys hear me? What about over here? Can you hear me over here? Yeah, so that's what basically the microphone sounds like. Uh, I'm pretty sure they could have put a three and a half millimeter jack in this thing, but of course they didn't because why they want to sell you an accessory. Now look at all the accessories. Look at all the extra money you can spend on this thing. So where's, where's the bloody thing? It's in, it's not here. Okay. So you got the bloody thing somewhere off screen here. Charging case. Wow. Okay. That's great. A wireless module. Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connection. So it doesn't, I guess, I didn't even know this, but it doesn't have a wireless Bluetooth thing. Okay, that's great. So you can spend, waste your money on that. You can waste your money on this controller wheel because, uh, you know, this is obviously, you're recording for, uh, you know, the theater or, or, or motion picture. Uh, quick release base. Okay, if you're doing some kinky stuff, you can buy that. So ND filters, of course, you need some ND filters because of that horrible auto exposures, uh, blowing out, underexposed, overexposed setting. So probably need that. Look, oh my God, hold on, what's this? A three and a half millimeter adapter. Wow, so now I can attach this thing that I'll probably lose a week after I buy it and shove it up the rear end of this thing and then shove a cable up there, a microphone, and then... Be, you know, no one points this out, but USB-C doesn't have like a locking mechanism. So, I mean, anyone that has a USB type charger phone knows, yeah, it it's kind of snug, 
but it can easily fall out. And by you shoving this thing in and out of its rear, however many times you will, these things get loose. Trust me, trust me. You could disagree with me. I've had a Google Pixel XL, Pixel 2 since it's come out, and that USB port on either end, the receiving end or the plug end, they get loose and eventually you're, they break, they break. There's a good chance you're gonna break the, uh, the connector on the inside of this if you use this very often. Same thing with, with this. Oh, this is, look how, wow, that's nifty. Look how nifty that is. So to make it a little bit convenient, you know, you can, you can shove it sideways into your phone. Then there's a dildo ca waterproof case and some sort of dildo extension rod. Like you don't have, um, like you don't have enough of these selfie sticks lying around. They got to introduce a new one. Uh, and then a the cover. I don't know. Does it come with this cover? Or you got to buy that too, probably. What the hell is this? An accessory mount. So anyways, that's why I think this thing is going to suck. Um, just my opinion. I, I, I like the fact that they came out with something so small, but they have to always ruin it by not including good audio and then all these adapters and it doesn't have a wireless in it. And, and, you know, okay, so why make it that? Why not make it? half an inch bigger and put Wi-Fi and Bluetooth in it. Anyways, don't subscribe, don't like. Talk to you guys later.